students and welcome to this video called the pH scale and you. One of the best ways I can show you the benefits of alkalizing is through this energy bank. As I'm talking today, I think the key thing here is just to become aware because this may be new information to you. If you can become aware, you'll be taking a huge step in taking back control of your health. Our bodies are 70 to 80 percent fluids and to maintain optimal health these fluids should be at 7.365 pH. This is no different than our body temperature which should remain at 98.6 in order to feel our best. The next time you buy a bottle of Evian water notice the label reads naturally pH balanced at 7.2. Our swimming pool testers indicate 7.4 is an ideal water condition as well. So what is it that affects our pH? Obviously, it's the foods we eat and our stressful lifestyle. We can see this visually on a pH scale. The pH scale is a standard measurement system we may have learned but probably forgot in high school. It's a ladder scale beginning at 0 through 14. 0 is equivalent to carbonic acid, the most acidic element, and 14 is bicarbonate, an alkalizing agent. 7 is in the middle and is neutral. So basically everything to the left of 7 is acidic and everything to the right of 7 is alkaline. Every single time we open our mouths and we decide to put something in, we're either making a deposit or making a withdrawal in our energy bank. It's as simple as that. If you look at some of the foods we eat and drink, like coffee with cream and sugar at 4.0 on the pH scale, it's a thousand times more acidic than distilled water. This would mean that coffee is a major energy withdrawal. Soft drinks with values of 3.0 are 10,000 times more acidic than distilled water. Can you see why you feel sick and tired when you eat acidic foods? You're withdrawing energy from your energy bank and your body is struggling to maintain 7.365 pH as you're draining the energy. It's simple arithmetic. Unfortunately, most of the foods and most of the choices are on the acidic or left side of the scale. Now, let's look at the deposit side of the pH scale, the right side, those foods that are considered alkaline. The pH value of broccoli, spinach, and all other green and yellow veggies is about 7.5 to 8.0 on the pH scale, or in other words, deposits into your energy bank. When you understand the pH factors of foods, you are in control and can choose correct nutrition for balance. As I said earlier, I think just becoming aware is a major milestone.